So you have a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 and you have an issue where you have a black screen here. Even though you have a black screen, you know the phone is still on. Maybe you can hear your hear um, uh, ringing from getting in phone calls. Maybe you can feel a vibration. Maybe you can hear notifications coming in. Another way to tell if the phone is on, if you go ahead and plug in your charging cable, if you plug it in, you should feel it vibrate and you should hear that little dink. I'll do it again. Plug it in here. You hear that? Okay. Now, obviously this one is fixed, but let's pretend I have a black screen here. Okay. We're going to go through several easy options to get you guys up and running right now. Okay. So the first thing we want to do is it doesn't matter if the phone is closed or it's open. What we want to do first thing is go ahead and force it to restart. Okay. So again, it doesn't matter if it's closed or open. Okay. So what we want to do to force restart it is, and let's pretend I have a black screen here. It's very simple, okay, for the force restart. What we want to do is when we press and hold two buttons simultaneously, it's going to be the uh, volume down and the power. Press and hold both buttons and do not let go until we see a Samsung logo appear, okay? So we're going to do it together, all right? So pretend my screen is black here. Uh, volume down, power, ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons. Pretend my screen is black here. I'm just holding on to the volume down and power. I'm going to keep on holding until I see a Samsung logo appear, okay? This typically takes maybe 15 or 20 seconds. Just keep holding, volume down, power. Still holding here and just wait for the Samsung logo to appear. Still holding. Still holding. Come on, where's that Samsung logo? Oh, there it is. Go ahead and let go. And now hopefully you are up and running. If not, we're going to go to the next possible solution. Okay, so next thing we're gonna do, uh, for this step it doesn't matter again if the phone is closed or open. I'll just go ahead and close it this time. But what we wanna do now, first thing is, what we wanna do is we wanna spam the power button, spamming it by pressing it in and out, okay? So go in and out, because a lot of times this power button, if it's like stuck or jammed or loose, it can cause a black screen as well, okay? So just keep spamming it like this, okay? Now, go ahead and plug in your Use the charging cable, plug it in there, okay? We're gonna go ahead and let it like charge for like a few seconds. And now, we're gonna force restart it again. Remember, volume down, power, ready? One, two, three, press and hold both buttons and do not let go until we see a Samsung logo appear, okay? And it is charging too, okay? So keep it chart, keep the, um, the cable plugged in and keep holding on to those two buttons and wait for a Samsung logo to appear. Again, volume down, power button, still holding, Again, it usually takes like 15 to 20 seconds, so I'm still holding volume down, power. Where's that Samsung logo? Come on. Oh, there it is. Go ahead and let go and wait for it to boot up to the login screen, and hopefully you are up and running now. If not, we're going to go to the next possible solution. All right, so next thing we're going to try, you can go ahead and unplug the phone from now. You can unplug it right now. And now what we're going to do is what I call the tap method. What we're going to do is we're going to tap the phone all over on the screen and all over on the back, okay? This would be easier if we just go ahead and open it up. And we'll start off on the screen here, okay? So what I want you to do is just hold the phone just like this and use two fingers and, I would, and just do this. Tap kind of hard, okay? Because a lot of times you can have something slightly dislodged, maybe even like a, a ribbon cable or whatnot, and a simple tap can pop it back into place. And as you're doing this sometimes, all of a sudden the screen will turn on. Okay, or maybe you'll get white lines, or maybe half of the screen will show up, or you'll get nothing. It'll just stay black. So keep tapping everywhere. Okay, yeah, it's still black. Okay, no problem. Let's flip it over, and let's do the same thing all over on here, okay? Tap. All over. Even on the lens here, all around the lens, keep tapping. Keep on tapping. And from here, too, you might see something pop on. All of a sudden, the screen might pop on. You might get white lines. You may get half a screen. And also on this side, okay, tap, two fingers, all over. Just keep on tapping. Keep on tapping. Ah, okay, it's still black, no problem. And from here again, remember, volume down power. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until we see the Samsung logo appear, okay? Again, I'm holding down the volume down and the power button. And let's pretend my screen is black here. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just hoping for a Samsung logo to appear. Still holding down both buttons. Still holding. Come on, where's that logo at? Still waiting. There it is. Go ahead and let go. And now hopefully you are up and running. If not, 
next solution. All right, so that last step didn't work for you. Next thing we're gonna try here is what I call the massage method. What we're gonna do is uh, go ahead and open the phone up, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna use two thumbs and we're gonna massage the entire screen and also on the back, okay? You can go ahead and get like a cloth or paper towel or something if you don't wanna smudge up the uh, your screen, but we're gonna start off like this, and I'm just gonna hold the back like this, and what I'm gonna do is press, press all over, okay? Give it like a nice massage. Sometimes you'll be hearing like, uh, um, like a little click and all of a sudden the screen will pop on okay anyway this is the same premise as the tapping method okay just keep pressing press give it like a nice massage okay use your thumbs okay press in press in and sometimes again sometimes you'll get half the screen pop on sometimes the whole entire screen will pop on sometimes you get like white lines just press press okay all over ah, still black no problem let's turn it back over and let's do the same thing on this side as well okay Massage it. Get, press in, 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 in. All over, okay? Even around the lens here, press in, press in, in, in. And sometimes you'll hear a click back here. And so, again, sometimes you're, you're doing the uh, massage method here. All of a sudden, you might see the screen pop on here as well, okay? Anyway, oh, okay, no problem. Black screen. Okay, so from here, we're going to force restart it again. Remember, Press and hold the volume down and power. Press and hold and do not let go until you see a Samsung logo. Once the Samsung logo appears, let go and now hopefully you are up and running. If not, next solution. So for this next solution here is what I call the smack method, okay? So what I want you to do is basically uh, open the phone up, hold your hand out like this, and what we're gonna do is, I mean, we're gonna smack it. So we start on one side here, okay? We'll start up, we'll do the screen side here, okay? Just give it up. A couple of wax. Look at the screen, nothing's going on, still black, no problem. Give it a couple of wax. Also on the bottom of the screen. Give it a couple of wax. Ah, black screen, no problem. Now we're gonna do the back, okay? Also on the on the bottom back. Ah, still black, no problem. Force restart. Remember, again now, press and hold, volume down, power button. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until we see a Samsung logo appear, then let go, okay? Anyway, if you're still down, we're going to go to the next solution. All right, so the last solution I have for you is what I call the freezer method. Why? Because what I want you to do is put the whole entire phone into the freezer. So grab your phone as is, and I want you to go ahead and open it up like this. And I want you to put this in your freezer, okay? The coldest part of your refrigerator. I want you to put it in just like this naked. Leave it in there for about 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, grab your cold phone and do the same thing. Volume down, power. Press and hold both buttons and do not let go until you see a Samsung logo appear. Then let go, okay? Now, hopefully, you guys are up and running. Now, the thing is, if you guys went through all of these steps and you're still down, then I want you to start off with step number one again and try every single step. Didn't work, try it a third time, a th uh, third time, fourth time. Try it all the way to seven times, okay? Sometimes the seventh time is a charm. Now, doing all these steps, I'm going to say at least 50% of you guys should have a working screen now. So if you do, uh, give, a, give a thumbs up on this video and mention uh, which step worked for you. And if it didn't work for you, give the thumbs down, okay? So we should see a 50-50. Good luck, guys.